this this is very simple. This is our home. This is where we're from, the cradle of our civilization. And there's an effort right now to wrest it from our hands. And Rabbi Shmuley uh, has gathered all of us here together to just say, no, no, we won't let this happen. And I think the Polish government doesn't want this to happen. I think the world, if they knew the facts, wouldn't want this to happen. I think that the Jewish people home and their ancestral homeland is the most organic and beautiful thing in the world. And there's a vestige of anti-Semitism that's rearing its ugly head here uh, at UNESCO in Krakow. Uh, we won't let them. Uh, we're certainly not going to forget where we're from, and we're not going to forget that this is our destiny to come back to this place. And we're not going to let people uh, make a pogrom in Jewish history here in beautiful Krakow, another ancient city. That We have a nexus, a relationship between ancient cities. We understand each other, ancient cultures. We won't let people who want to erase uh, Jewish memory uh, and Jewish presence, uh, because by saying this, not only are they erasing Jewish memory, but they're also justifying a jihad against us by calling us occupiers in our ancestral homeland. We won't let that happen. Rabbi Shmuley, I want to thank you again. May this Torah that in the first chapters of the Torah talks about Abraham's purchase uh, of the burial plot for Sarah and the rest of the biblical family in Hebron may it be a testament uh, to that truth and may the Jewish people uh, live long and prosper in the land and certainly in Hebron, our first capital and our ancestral homeland.